Hello, everybody. I did not steal this idea. Is this stealing an idea? Kind of, but like, there's there's a reason behind it. If you didn't know, me and Gooba are trying to become number one on the leaderboard. Whoever doesn't do it first has to sell their Wobbox. I'm doing whatever I can to make it to number one, all right? Uh, what he did was he got a bunch... He also copied the idea. Like, it's not... It's just a thing. So, there was a fella who was number one on the leaderboard. Or number two, I can't remember. And all he did was place a bunch of toe jammers on his cold island. Like, just full... Filled the whole thing. Uh, and what Gooba did, he just did it with mammoths. I, I can't do it on my cold island. It's, it's pretty corrupt. Same with my, my plant island. It's a bit... It's a bit corrupt. But I can do my water island. But at the same time, I can also afford a Wobbox. Why am I doing the memory game? Hold on. Why am I so good at this? What the hell? Why am I so good at this? Yes. I think I might have the ADHD. I keep getting distracted. I'm going to make this video, this island, go out with a bang and put them all in a Wobbox. Should I? Yeah, I'm going to do it because then in that case, I'm going to one-up Gooba and I am better than Gooba. Oh, I've done it. Oh, God. No, just shut up. Go in the box. Go in the shitty box. Get in the 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 box. Move. I want to get Cybop. I can't reach. Get in the box. Box him. I f hopefully, I have every single monster. Oh. Octopus. I swear, every day, every day, I'm growing to like Pop Belly more. He might be my favorite monster. Feed him up till number four. Lovely. Box him. And that should be everyone. All right, I'm going to place all the noggins first. And then I'm going to wake up the, the Wobbox. Oh, I don't, I don't even need the bonus nurture. It basically happens instantly. If you didn't know, every new monster, well, if you place the two of the same monster, it's actually louder. I'm going to be placing like a hundred. So it's going to be uh, bonkers. Uh, while, I, while I'm doing this, I'm going to tell a story. Because Gooba did the same thing. I'm not stealing ideas, guys. I'm not stealing. But my, my story is actually interesting. So if you didn't know, there's such... There's such thing as a Minecraft theater, and I, I did that as a kid, and it's a proper professional thing. Like, they had the whole setup. It's part of the Minecraft company. It's, like, proper. So how it works is that we all bring our computers in. So I brought in my laptop, and, and it was, like, it was connected to, like, uh, a server. Well, they weren't screen showing my screen, but they showed, like, a cinematic screen, and that would be shown on, like, a big projector. And we did, like, little acting parts in between it. So how it worked is that on that screen, we would do, like stories like Beowulf. It was really fun. I, I'm so glad I got to do it. But I was I was too cool to be like everyone else and just do the acting. I had to be mischievous. <laughs> when I wasn't supposed to be on screen, when I wasn't supposed to be reading my lines, I used to try and butt my little head in in the corner of every like scene. Uh, I thought it was going to be really funny, but no one noticed. I was like, because my friend, one of my friends went, I was like, did you see me in the background? He was like, no. So <laughs> it was a lot funnier in my head. And now I think about it, it was really stupid because it was a professional thing and they could have just kicked me out. But also, we were also all in creative, so we could do we could do anything. Whenever I wasn't on screen, and when I, because I have a really short attention span, I just went. Well, I was like conservative about it. Like I didn't, I didn't just blow TNT in front of everyone and destroy it at all the buildings. But I used to go like pretty far away and just blow the map up. I still blew up the map, but like I was. I was nice about it, you know what I mean? There were only four people chosen in the whole world to do this, and I chose to do that. So when the actual, like, shows came on, there were, like, five nights that we had to do it. I didn't- I didn't do mischievous deeds as much. I still did them, but, like, I was- I was nice about it. Are we gonna have enough beds? I didn't even think about that. But at one point, which I found hilarious, I- I had to stop my laughter. So how it works is that every scene, they have to teleport us to a new area, and they had, like, command blocks, which they used to use, or, like, some guy in the background who used to just teleport us. At one point, when I was teleported to the new scene, and it was, like, my line, I- that was, like, one of my only lines in the whole thing, because they knew I was an idiot. My- my game crashed, like, completely. But, like, my character was still in game, and for some reason, he was just shaking his head, like, like wildly around. I, I wanted to laugh, but I knew that would ruin the thing, so I had to keep- I had to keep speaking- Oh, God. I had to keep speaking 
Well, um, my, my character was shaking his head, like, all around. I, and then they cut to the next scene, and it was all fine. It was kind of fine, because when, you know, whenever, like, whenever you need to let the audience know you're speaking, you shake your, nod your head up and down. That's another story. I could tell you the story how I got robbed. Wait, that's too serious. I've only got bad stories, because those are the only ones that I remember. That was the only, like, funny one, kind of. Uh, I've got another story about how I was in a theatre thing. Uh, yeah, I used to do theatre. Uh, so, it was... I think it was also Beowulf. I didn't realise I did so many Beowulf things. No, it was Macbeth. I was like Macbeth's son or something. Uh, and <laughs> I thought it was really... F I had to like scream. So every show I had to scream a lot. Like the highlight of the show was whenever some guy ran in and just like threw me over his shoulder. I just ran, up, ran off the stage. I was at, I was with my cousins. <laughs> you know here, Brian. You know how his name is spelt Brian and not Brian? <laughs> well, my cousin tried to like scare us all by joining the game and say saying their name is Hero Brian. Like it was on the phone, so you could change a name as much as you wanted. Uh, and they spell it Brian. <laughs> okay, I've realized that you can. I am allowed to have the essential buildings. Oh no. Oh oh. I, I Oh no, I can't even upgrade it. <laughs> Guys, I think the only option- Oh my god. The only option is for this video to be a two-parter. That is the only option, but don't worry. This first part won't be, um, nothing. Because I'll be breaking up the Robux. It's fine, it's fine, everyone. Calm, calm your tits. We did good. We've built some sort of army. Next upgrade, I'll have it finished. You know how you guys can help me? You could go into- go into options, uh, okay, Sub press the submit referral, and use this code. This will give me, uh, five gems, and if, like, ten of you guys do that, that's like 50 gems, and those 50 gems I could use to complete, uh, do more videos like this. So please, please! We're gonna wake up this box with my army of nog- oh, what the- what- what are these? Moy eyes. So this is considered clickbait now, since I didn't actually do it. Bruh. Alright. Let's wake up this Wobox. I'm sorry. Three. No, wait. Three. Two. One. <gasps> Go! Oh, it's Mammox! Oh! Why is it Mammox? Oh, no. Hold on a second. Did you- Did you guys notice this? No way! I didn't notice that. That just snuck its way in. You are the cars of this island. Can I sell this? Let me- let me try and sell it. Alright, I'll just press- I'll press the sell button. It just didn't sell. Oh no! Oh, I put so much effort into this island, please, man! Okay. Uh, I'm worried for what part two is gonna be. If you guys wanna see, you need to press the notifications and the subscribe button. Please- I